So, I took your advice and I thought, what does the audience want to hear? And I made a list of wedding symbols. Um, rings, pretty obvious. Mm -hmm. And wow. arches, rebirth, etc. Symbols. If I love you, I'm not gonna bury my feelings in purple prose and metaphors. I'll just tell you, I love you. I mean, I don't mean I love you. <laughs> Of course not. You hate me. You know what I mean. <laughs> no, we don't oh, know what you mean. We James. just want to know what you mean. <laughs> I don't love you. That comes in Act 6. Oh, it's, it is a Hallmark movie. You. How much fun uh, are these movies? Well, Last they're thing. getting to be more and more fun. With this one, that was Sherry Som, who is brilliant in this movie. She, we had no idea if she could sing, or and she's oh, so perfect. And then my son is in it, yeah. Shepard, and he's wait. he's fantastic. So this one was more fun than most. Okay, okay wait, tell us about your son. son. What's his role? What does he do? He plays my son in the uh -huh. movie, Teddy. Uh, and it's, uh, Sherry is his college poetry professor, <laughs> with whom I fall in love. Uh -huh. And he's uh, sort of the, the cause cautionary version like he from? warns me about what could go wrong and he's worried about me he getting hurt again water. I'll just stop talking you can hear him act I mean and by the way you said like there, that this time together was this incredible the, gift what was it like yeah. gift from God it's the best month of my life we, it, we were just spending that time in a hotel in Winnipeg working on the movie and talking some acting but it's also music driven this is a, a lot of original music in this he's a brilliant musician we oh. both play in the movie, and I have to sing with, thankfully, the help of pitch correction. <laughs> but uh, so it was, it's a very unique for Hallmark in that it's, it's a music-driven vehicle. Has music yeah. always been one of your loves? It has. Growing up in Nashville, you know, they kind of hand you a guitar when you're about 12. Yeah. And, and I'm a decent player, but he's fantastic. He's blown past me. So do you ever get the um, urge, like when you see him doing something that you know you could easily correct, all you have to do is just do a tweak, do you say to him, hey, look, honey, I, I have That's something a lot here? Of, lot of tongue biting yeah because <laughs> luckily he's talented he's very he's very good so there wasn't much of that but yeah as as an actor you would never do that but as a dad you want to go yeah. you know what and especially things like just being in somebody's light and hitting your mark and, and yeah. off camera eye line was all new to him he's never done it and he picked it up like that. He and he, I think people really enjoy him in it. I mean, I love how you talk about him. Yeah. Also, yeah. your daughter. Yes, yes. thank is you. Also going thank into you. acting. Yeah. Before and you I, get me in trouble, yes, my <laughs> daughter Malin. She just got cast as the lead in Mamma Mia. They cast her. Yeah, what? they cast her in, in high school. But it's it, she goes to there she is. She goes to a pretty big high school with a couple thousand kids. And I heard you and bought she all couldn't the believe, tickets. Couldn't believe. Couldn't. Well, yeah, I'll, I'll go to all twelve shows. <laughs> but so yeah, she's going to be the lead of Mamma Mia, and she's never done anything like that. So, so she went out on a limb and, and auditioned, and I'm very happy. So she, she sings, you sing, well, your son performs. Yeah, their mom. They got all the musical talent all from the their, music mom. their mom. Yeah. Is there I'm, ever a, a thought of like a, you could do a family band? Yeah. You could have concerts. Yes. We could go. Very we would go. Very Von Trapp. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> First in the song somewhere. Yeah, they they could. Yeah, there's her band. There's Malin. I'm oh, so cool. glad she's getting some time because she didn't get to do a movie, but she's a rocker. You know, there's oh my something. God, look at her crowd. Oh, yeah, that's they not, look, yeah. That's that, a big that's deal. Her, that's her band, Dead Mother Scavenger. Wait, Dead so, Mother find, Scavenger. Dead that sounds like a band I would have loved in the 90s. <laughs> yeah. There's something about watching your kids yeah. soar. Uh -huh. We've talked oh. about this like in silly uh -huh. ways when, when uh -huh. our kids have had recitals and plays and stuff. Like, it's almost uh -huh. so much better, out of, right? Uh -huh. right? Or, or, yeah, or you're in the audience watching them and you're just white knuckling yes. because you, you're so nervous for them and they don't, they're not nervous at all. No. Uh -huh. But, yeah, it, it's to, so different. And that's the great thing. Thing about parenting, we've talked about this before, how it takes the focus off of you finally, mm -hmm. this self-absorbed acting, this industry we're in. Mm -hmm. You have kids and suddenly you don't worry about, or I don't, yeah. what I'm wearing or if I even take a shower. It's all about yeah. the kids mm -hmm. and getting that focus off you is, I think, healthy. Yeah, you have, definitely. You've yeah. got a big birthday coming up, mister. Well, thanks for reminding me. Oh, no. yeah. You'll never catch me. Never catch you. But how does, how does 60 feel or the idea of it? 60, you know... I never pay much attention, yeah. and as my dad always said, it beats the alternative. True I'm, that. I'm not, I'm not having one. Mm -hmm. um, but 60, I'm noticing. Yeah, 50, yeah. I was. It came and went. Yeah. But for some reason, 60 sounds. But you know, both my parents uh, passed away really young. Yeah. So ever since then, I've kind of been a carpe diem guy, and it's like every week or day is kind of a gift. Mm. So you know, you're not guaranteed anything. So 60 shouldn't matter. But you start getting those AARP cards in the mail and stuff. <laughs> and yeah, I throw them in the trash like they're hot potatoes. Um, right. But, you know, it, it's, but it's come here. On, there and... are some good senior discounts on those babies. <laughs> it is. Yes, again, you get some discounts. Yeah. So you, I'm noticing this one. Yeah. But, 
you know, it, it, you kind of, I don't pay much attention to it because it doesn't do any good. It seems like gratitude and faith yeah. are oh, yeah. really yeah. big in yeah. your life. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, mm -hmm. I have so many friends that are much more talented than I am that, that mm -hmm. struggle to make it. That you, you, it's, uh, you have to be grateful. Mm -hmm. And being able to do something like this, and I owe Hallmark, Elisa Hamilton Daly and Wanya Lucas, what they're doing over there. Yeah. Um, evolving that network in a wonderful way. Um, and allowing me to do this with my son. I mean, oh. I don't know who else would have let me do yeah. that. Oh, it's a home run. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. James, it's so good to see you. We love when you visit us. Mm -hmm. Thank you, you too. so well, thanks much. Thanks for having me. And thanks for giving my kids some airtime. Yes, we love <laughs> it. Of course. And Perfect Harmony, it premieres this Sunday night on Hallmark Movies and Mysteries. <laughs>